Okay, so here we are, uh, right after going fishing, and the boat is now, Sea Badger is now in the uh, washdown rack. I've just washed her down. You can see the helm station. Um, you can see the throttle controls and her GPS, two GPS, one with uh, Garmin HD radar, and the Uniden. You can see down inside her berth here, kind of come down, and there's a privacy curtain. That's where you see this black thing there. That's the privacy curtain that hangs right around here. If you can see my hand here, it hangs right around here on the edge. So it blocks it off. It's access to the anchor locker in the front. You have storage. Let's come back a bit. You can see the uh, passenger seat with the bar. See the windows. Get an idea of what it looks like inside here. You can see the rear column. And this one has an Alaskan bulkhead. The doors are closed in the back. Kind of take you over here and you can see how the seat arrangements are. So you can kind of see that you have passenger seat and then you have a like a bench seat and this bench seat I'm gonna go over to it quickly it lifts up and in it you can kind of see down there is another piece and that attaches to these metal connectors and this actually makes a bed between that seat you go in the back see the seat there and that seat so in between there's a connector that sits between them and that's where the one bed is um, that big round black thing there, that's access to the gas tank um, gauge, basically. Tells you your float control, tells you how much gas you have. Uh, again, coming to this side, you can see we have another, another bench seat. And then this is the helm seat. Going back up to the helm. So, not a huge boat. Oh, then you can see that this middle piece here, back to the berth, this middle piece comes up and under it is storage. I cur currently have two chairs that I go in the back so when this boat is moving I can have basically seven people give you a better view. We can have seven people on board. We can have uh, the uh, captain, passenger, two people behind the passenger. The seat is bigger. The bench seat there is bigger. And then on the other side of the boat we have the single seat. You could probably squeeze two people if you needed to. And then with those two chairs, we can go in the back in the cockpit and put two people there. I'll open this up so you can. So we can open up one side by itself. And we'll step through. You can see the cockpit. Not it. So you have lots of storage on the sides around to the back. This is where the battery is on this boat. Some down you can see in the battery switch. Okay, let's close that. And then the other side of the cockpit, the gunnels. Lots of these really sturdy cleats. This boat happens to have the, the uh, step ups. I guess that's an additional. Then in the cockpit floor itself, you can see the compartment. I'm going to lift this thing up. You can notice the construction of this thing. I mean, just the brackets alone are massive. And that's actually the build. This is a good time to point out how many different um, sealed off sections there are in this boat. So if you can see down there, there's one plug. Come around to this side. There's another plug. Then I'm going to flip it completely around. Come do it slowly so I don't lose you. And there you see there's three more plugs. So this boat is completely sealed off one section from the other. So you can actually lose a section. If you, I mean, if you possible to smash it and make a hole in it. The boat's still going to stay afloat. Let's put that down. Behind it is the actual bilge. You'll see that. Move some of this fishing line out of the way. Up. 
Then you can see here's the bilge. And the bilge pump. And you see this, this one right there. That actually gives access from this down into the lower bilge that we saw. So this pump actually, that when the water comes from the cockpit, it just lands here overboard uh, with this um, bilge pump. Keeps itself pretty clean. Easy, very easy to uh, wash down. Just you know, hose down this whole area. All ends up in here, poof, overboard. So really rather cool. And this piece, even though it's not down, it fits really snugly and it doesn't move around when the boat's going. Okay, let's come over the back. Oh, before I go there, I'll show you this. So here's the walkway out under here. Back so you can see it is the piece that slides into here. And that kind of gives you, you know, extra protection, extra gunnel height when you're out in the water. Let's take that off. So we'll just go ahead and put it away. It just lines up and grooves over here. Okay. So let's go out the back. You can see it's got a swim step. No, and then this boat happens to have a single Yamaha 225 sport model with uh, Sea Star hydraulic steering, and it's got a swim step. Okay.